Let's talk about a growing phenomenon in Western societies known as tiredness of life. As we age, many of us experience a loss of identity, physical abilities, loved ones, and even careers. This can lead to a sense that life has lost its meaning. But what exactly is this tiredness of life? Professor Helena Larsen and her colleagues in Sweden describe it as a gradual turning out of the lights. Individuals slowly detach from life, reaching a point where they're ready to disconnect from the external world. Unlike other forms of suffering, this tiredness lacks any desire for or mourning of a future. It's a profound sense of completion, a feeling that the journey should end. In countries where euthanasia and assisted suicide are legal, the prevalence of tiredness of life has sparked intense debate. Does it constitute enough emotional suffering to justify such choices? This discussion reveals a potential societal shift. Modern Western societies may have marginalized older adults, diminishing their value and wisdom. Contrast this with cultures like Japan, where aging is viewed positively. Aging there is seen as a time for rebirth and personal growth after years of work and family responsibilities. This cultural difference suggests that the Western experience of aging might contribute to tiredness of life. Surgeon Atul Gawande argues that Western medicine's focus on extending lifespan has created a long, slow fade for many. By prioritizing biological survival over a meaningful existence, we may have inadvertently fueled this phenomenon. But here's the good news. Despite the challenges of aging, personal growth and fulfillment are still possible in later life. Susan Pickard, director of the Center for Aging and the Life course at the University of Liverpool, emphasizes this potential. Take Diana Athill, for example. Athill found a renewed purpose and creativity in her 90s, publishing memoirs that reflect on her experiences of deep old age. Her story exemplifies the potential for discovering new joys and perspectives even in later life. Athill's example highlights a societal blind spot. We need to recognize and support older adults' capacity for growth and fulfillment. By shifting our perspective and providing opportunities for meaningful engagement, we can help our older generations find purpose and combat the sense of tiredness of life. So let's rethink how we view aging. Let's celebrate the wisdom and potential that come with it. And most importantly, let's ensure that life in later years remains meaningful and fulfilling. Thanks for watching. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content on important societal issues.